hello guys welcome back to yet another prestigious opportunity in today's video we are going to be talking about a fully funded scholarship in germany which you can use to study any master's or phd program at any university in my previous video we i talked about the dad eps scholarship i had a lot of questions uh, because a lot of persons did not find their course on the list of courses that are eligible for the dad epos so if you are part of those persons this scholarship is definitely for you because you can study any program using this scholarship so this is the frederick norma foundation scholarship um, which you can use to study any master's program in germany so we're going to get into it right away because i'm going to take you through a presentation where we're going to talk about all you need to know about the scholarship um, what is involved the eligibility and how to apply to this scholarship this video is fully packed and you definitely do not want to skip through before we get started hit the like button and if you're not subscribed hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification so that you do not miss future opportunities also do not forget to sign up on grammarly with the link in the description grammarly is a free tool that can help you avoid errors while writing letters of motivation so let's get into the presentation right away so we're talking about the frederick norma foundation scholarship so like i said it is a fully funded scholarship and it is for masters and phd and there are no age limits and you do not need to provide work experience you also do not need to provide language tests like tofu or iets it is not mandatory and also um, you do not have to provide recommendations from your employers or from where you work and uh, you also do not need to certify your documents and like i said you can use this for any course at any university in germany and um, the application period is there are two application periods and uh, you can apply between 1st to 30th of april or you can also apply between the 1st and 31st of October every year. So that is it. You can make sure to apply between these within these periods. Okay. And let's talk about the benefits of this scholarship. Um, it is tuition free. It's definitely where you have to apply to um, a university that is tuition free in Germany. So I already talked about um, a video. I, I, I made a video where I talked about how to find tuition free universities and courses so make sure to check that out on my channel and the first thing you want to do is to apply to a tuition free course in any university and also um, the benefits include 861 euro monthly for masters as well as 1200 euros monthly for um, phd this scholarship also covers your health insurance now let's talk about the eligibility uh, it is for international students all international students are eligible so you can either be abroad or you are already in germany so you can also apply to this scholarship um, it is very important um, talking about grades or cgpa that are eligible um, it was not specified by this scholarship however on the website they wrote good to very good grades or academic achievements um, is needed and you also have to be interested in politics and um, it doesn't mean you have to study politics but you have to be interested in politics governing uh, of people and um, you need to be a liberal or a freedom fighter so these are basically people who um, fight for the rights of others so you fight for the civil or the human right of others or you are interested in such um, you don't want people to be oppressed so this kind of people are what they are looking for and uh, they are more likely to get this scholarship um, it doesn't have to relate to the course that you are studying but um, you generally are a liberal okay and you also need to hold an offer of study um, a full-time study of masters or phd in germany so that is the first step to apply for admission and uh, asylum seekers in germany are also eligible but make sure to check the website on um, the the terms and conditions and also importantly um, German language is important or necessary for this scholarship and the courses you are studying might be in English or definitely will be in English but, but as seen on their website they asked 
do you need to have knowledge of German? And the answer is yes. And they went further to state that the application document must be submitted in German. They went further to state that the selection interview will also take place in German. So um, this is quite new because I have a friend who got a scholarship like two years ago. He did not have to um, use German in the interview. But however, I see this as um, one challenge, but in another way, it is also an advantage because this might eventually reduce the number of persons who would want to go for the scholarship and then increases the chances of those who wants to get to learn German uh, before uh, maybe October to get the, it increases their chances of getting this scholarship. And if you have more questions about the German requirement, you can um, contact the scholarship body through their phone number or uh, the email. You can write to them um, how the particular documents that are needed in German because definitely your certificates would be in English or depending on the country, depending on your country and your language. Um, however, we do not know the particular documents that are necessary, um, that necessarily have to be in German. You can always send an email to this email address to inquire more about this and we are going to look at the necessary documents um, next but in terms of german you can start learning german um, i'm going to drop a link in the description to skillshare you can learn german on skillshare you just have to search for a german course and register through the link that you're going to find in the description so let's take a look at the required documents so you can see right here i'm going to drop a link to this um, pdf file also in the description so you can take a look at it i'm also going to drop a link to the official scholarship page in the description so here you can see the required document you need so you need a cv you need an identification document like your passport or identity card and you also need your university admission or enrollment certificate so that is the first step getting admission from a german university and you can see right here you also need your diploma degree which qualifies you to. so in that case um, if you are going for a, a master's degree um, you need your bachelor's degree and if you are going for a phd you need your master's degree and um, you also need your academic transcripts as well as um, other certificates of vocational uh, training or professional activities whatever you have been involved in um, this is quite important and it can help you to stand out um, to show that you have done some activities you can also take a look at the um, reference letters that are important or needed um, right here you can see you need two reference letters from your university professors or scientific employees so um, this is the part that concerns you if you are going for um, uh, a master's so you can also take a look at these requirements and i think that is all right here those are the documents that are needed to apply to this um, scholarship right here did not include motivation letter so i'm not quite sure i don't think you might need the motivation letter so you can see right here also it states that all documents must be submitted in either german or english so well right here so i think you're on the safe side if you submit some of these documents in english because it is stated right here that all documents must be submitted in either german or english and make sure to um, submit them in pdf we're going to look at how to apply very soon so make sure to keep watching right now let's take a look at how to apply to this scholarship so the first thing you want to do is to check out my video where i talked about how to search for tuition free universities in germany to make sure you are applying to a tuition free university or a tuition free course so that video is going to guide you and thereafter you apply for admission to any of any course and once you've done that and you've gotten your uh, admission offer submit your app scholarship application uh, on the Frederick Normal Foundation portal which we are going to take a look at right away I'm also going to drop a link to that page in the description so you'll get notified um, of the outcome by email and then they're also going to invite you to participate in a video interview if you are successful so right now let's take a look at the official page so right here you can see the website of the Frederick Normal Foundation and um, there's a lot that you can get from this page make sure to read through 
um, it is very important and you can see what is needed who that the kind of persons they are looking for you can see the idea of um, liberalism so you have to be a Libra or you are interested in that or at least you can prove that in a way so quite important and if you go down this page you are going to find um, some frequently asked questions and answers which will also guide you so you can check you can click on the one that applies to you and when you click on it you come down you can see frequently asked questions as you can see right here and you can just click on the drop down and read what is there like the application period um how will i be notified after submitting my online application so that's this, these are some of the things you can find right here and you can get more information and when you are ready to apply to this scholarship after you must have gotten admission to one german university then you can come ahead to the application portal still on this website right here so you click on the application portal it takes you to this page where you can go down and um, click on this link right here zoom online uh, so this is to the online application tool so you can click on that you just have to click on this link right here and it takes you to the application portal so the next thing you want to do is to click on um, noir um, registering so this is new registration so you click on this to register um, as a first timer so um, it is quite simple yeah you just complete the the form if you cannot understand what is written here you can use a translator but i think it is quite clear this is your first name Voname. Uh, nakname is your last name so this is your email address and this is your password so um, you might want to get a translator you can use google translate to just copy out this stuff and paste um, then translate to english so it is quite simple um, what is most important is that you are not going to study in german when you come over you are studying in english but um, the application process might be in german so, so that is it all you need to do is to register then you log in so once you are logged in you can continue to fill the application and submit all the necessary documents and apply make sure you apply within the application period this is a reoccurring scholarship so it occurs every year during the application period so that is it for this video i wish you the best of luck also do not forget to check out my youtube channel you can see the videos i talked about um, this is an opportunity a financial opportunity from our mmo series make money online uh, i talked about how to make money from pico workers you can also check out this video and um, we talked about the scholarship um, in uk right here and a lot of other scholarships how to search for um, scholarships in germany you can check out this video and if you're interested in tuition free universities in norway you can check out this video you can find this video right here where i talked about how to search for tuition free universities uh, in germany for bachelor's masters and phd so that's it guys hit the like button drop a comment and i'll see you in my next video there are a lot of opportunities um, coming your way make sure you are subscribed and bye